Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome to episode 24 of Ask Think Noodles. Now, before I get to the questions, I want to make like a public service announcement about the questions for Ask Think Noodles. From now on, please only ask one question per comment. I've been choosing all your questions and they're getting so long that the episodes are getting to be almost 30 minutes long and I'd like to keep them around 10 to 15 minutes because those 30 minute episodes take me almost five hours to do. So I want to get them down a little bit further so that it's more manageable and I'm not spending my entire day doing them. So let's get started with the questions and Michelle Lee asks, can I please, please, please be the first question in episode 24? And yes, you can, and the reason being because you asked a funny question, which is, do you wanna hear two short jokes and one long joke? Joke, joke, joke. I like that. And the next two people ask about whether I like playing Club Penguin and Pop Tropica, and why do I play Club Penguin and Pop Tropica? And I do like playing both of them, and the reason I like playing is, this morning is a great example. I was in Club Penguin, I was doing the uh, Operation Blackout, cheats video and someone said hey i want to show you something really cool and they showed me how to get to the end of operation blackout early and that was awesome and i had a great time doing that and i had a great time making the video to show you guys how to do it matthew green asks if i like kids and yes of course i do i don't have any of my own but i like playing with you guys the next two people ask, why don't you join the Club Penguin team if they offered you a job? Well, it depends on the job that they offered me, but I would definitely consider joining the Club Penguin team because I know what you guys like. Pokeants2347 says, hey, Think, what do you do when you're not on YouTube? Uh, well, I spend so much time on YouTube, I actually don't even know what, I'm not, what I do when I'm not on YouTube. Then they ask, also, would you do a special on Ask Think where it would be titled A Day with Think Noodles? And that sounds intriguing and interesting. What exactly did you have in mind for that? Angel Rocks Socks 925 asks, if you could be any animal, what would you be? I think I'd be a tiger because they're such beautiful animals. Although I'm allergic to cats and I found out that I'm allergic to tigers when I pet one uh, because they're cats. So I'd have to get that fixed. Now the next like four questions are about Minecraft and they ask if I'm going to play Minecraft with Grazer and whether I'd open a server or a public server. I'm not really sure what any of that means, but I do plan to play with Grazer and I guess maybe open a public server once I figure out exactly what that means. Plushy518 says, so this leads me to a question. What days and times do you record stuff like Field Ops and Smoothie King? As far as Smoothie King, I just play that whenever I feel like playing it. But for the Field Ops videos, I almost always record them on Icicle on Thursdays at 6 a.m. Eastern Time, which is 3 a.m. Penguin Time. JD Miller asks, why are you in jail with supervillains? Well, I'm not anymore. If you check my location, I'm now in Willy Wonka's factory. Mario Christensen says, for the third time, when do you think your friends list will be fixed? Well, it's kind of fixed right now um, because I can receive friend requests and I can send them out for now. Arwen Gosh says, think how old am I? I'm nine or eight. Well, since you capitalized nine, nine? I do have a Minecraft account called The Real Think Noodles. Fan, am I a boy or a girl? Look at my name and watch Lord of the Rings. Well, I don't have to watch Lord of the Rings. I've read it and Arwen is a girl. Mr. Black Knight 62 said, would you rather have a thousand pounds, a thousand dollars, or a thousand euro? I'd choose pounds. That's a good choice. So would I. Kelly Lopez asks, which is worse, Sandy or Katrina? Well, that's an interesting question because I've sort of experienced both. I wasn't in the location for either one during the hurricane, but I went back to New Orleans just after Katrina, so I saw the damage there, and of course I came back to New York after Sandia and I saw the damage here. And I will say that the damage was worse in Katrina, also mostly because, because the people that were the worst affected in Katrina were people who didn't have a lot of money, and this really devastated them. In Sandy, there's a there's more money in New York, and so the city recovered more quickly. 
Fernando Flores says, but think there's going to be another storm in New York and it's called Athena. So please look at this and move to another state. Oh my God, I'm scared you might die. Uh, Athena was just a snowstorm and I still wasn't even here yet. So no problem. I didn't die. 1999 Blue says, can you guess my age? I'm under 100. I would guess that you are probably 14 based on the 1999. Pavan Man asks, think, what is your favorite hockey player? You know, I haven't watched hockey in a really long time, so I couldn't even guess. Angelina Narayan asks, do you eat noodles? Please answer this one. Did you know that Club Penguin was going to have an Operation Blackout and find Shadow Dojo two years ago? I didn't know that. Did you guys know that? Amadeo the Ben asks, what's a Gemini? Um, a Gemini is an astrological symbol based on your birthday. The next person asks, try to pronounce my username. Um, no, I can't. <laughs> and my inspiration for making Club Penguin and Pop Tropica videos? I kind of didn't have one. I just started making them on my own as I thought they should be made. Kelly Lopez asks, do you have a job? Um, this is my job. And you read on Pop Tropica that I was bald. Not in real life, but my penguin is bald. And I've already beat Wimpy Wonderland. You can see my full walkthrough on my channel. And I've just recently uploaded the Wimpy Wonderland Road to Captain Think Noodles, although it's still private right now, but I do have it. Ryan DeMonte says, you're awesome. I love your videos and your posts on Club Penguin Insiders. So I thank you. What do I think of Big Bang Theory? My parents actually watch it a lot. I can't get into it. Uh, I steal bald monkey sandwiches because they're delicious. And if I had to quit one, I would quit Pop Tropica. And I really like Spike Hike and Polo Field. They're really making an effort to integrate themselves in the community and do community events. I really, really like it. Ariel Branson Love says, why do you keep distracting me from my homework? Well, I'm really sorry to be so incredibly entertaining. Vale Penguin says, if you could choose one item in Club Penguin, what would it be? It would, for me, it would be the first year party hat and not the beta hat. That's interesting. I think I would choose the beta hat. Now, the next two people ask about Kopi and whether I can show her a picture. She just turned six, and I'll do one better. I'll show you a video of her right now. Okay, Kopi, don't be shy. My subscribers want to say hi. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Good girl. Here you go. Go ahead. Good girl. This is Kopi. She's smiling. Smile, girl. <laughs> Alright, this is my kitchen, and I'm not going to show you guys the rest of my apartment because it's such a mess, but this is my kitchen window, and that's the Empire State Building. Just showing you guys a little bit of New York, because someone asked me to show them New York in a picture, and I figured a little bit of a video would be better. So there you go, you got to meet Kopi, and you got to see a bit of New York. Matt L. asks, hey, think, what's your first video you talked in? Uh, I had to look back, but I think it was the road to Captain Think Noodles for early Pop Tropica Island, and you can listen to it, and I don't have a great microphone, and I stumble a lot, and there's a lot of pauses. Not a great video, but you can check it out. Ask Justy Jumba X says, I just got a new haircut. Guess what it is? Um, a mohawk? Lucas60CP asks, do you know what Beats Audio is? Of course I do. People wear them everywhere here. Angie NG Mellon says, you never answer my questions. If you don't answer this question, I will eat all your bald monkey sandwiches and think noodles. Club Penguin user, which supervillain is your favorite? Um, I like Binary Bard. La101 Lala says, have you watched Wreck-It Ralph? I'm going to wreck it. By the way, did you like the name Thinky? Well, I have not watched Wreck-It Ralph, but I really, really want to. AZ Fire on 217 asks, when is Charlie and the Chocolate Factory Island coming out for non-members? According to Pop Tropica's website, it'll be available to everyone on December 6th. D in a trance says, are you a moderator or a regular guy just walking through CP and making videos? Well, I am not a moderator. I'm just a regular guy walking around CP and I'm glad to make you nostalgic. You should come back and play. Pretty Forever 76 asks, what started your love of noodles and when did you eat your first noodle? Well, when I was a young noodle, I had a bowl of low men that would make a grown man cry. And from then on, I've always loved noodles. 
<laughs> I, honestly, I have no idea. I don't remember. Dabupi says, ignore my other comment. I messed up. Anyway, here's my question. Are you ticklish? I hate being tickled. Uh, you know, I uh, no one's tried to tickle me in a really long time, so I can't remember, but I used to be. Jacob00 says, do you think, what headset do you use for your videos? I actually don't use a headset. I have a standalone mic. Bob the Blob 20 says, what do you think about the Wii U being released? Well, it should be out already, I think, and I haven't checked it out. The controller looks enormous, and I'm not sure how I'm going to feel about that, but I'm going to go check it out at the Nintendo World over in Rockefeller Center. Ali Webb says, can my YouTube name be the next title on Ask Think Noodles? Please, I will be your best noodle friend. Please, please, I beg of you. Well, look at the title. Is it there? <laughs> yep, my YouTube name is the title. Victoria200111 asks, around the end of July, did you see a bunch of teenage girls around New York? Well, I don't know if you've ever been to New York, but it's a really, really, really crowded place. And I couldn't tell if I saw a bunch of teenagers or not. The next person says, come to Egypt. And man, I would love to come to Egypt. That's one of my dreams is to go on vacation there. Crossfire70352 asks, what are the symptoms of asthma? And it really depends on the person, but asthma can be allergy induced or exercise induced. I have allergy induced asthma, so it doesn't bother me when I exercise, but uh, shortness of breath and wheezing uh, are two really telltale signs of asthma. And you can have mild to severe symptoms, and during an attack, you just feel like you're, you can't breathe, like someone's suffocating you, and it's, it's a scary feeling. SM Bro asks, what kind of games did you play when you were a little kid? Well, that depends on what you mean by little kid. Uh, when I was really young, we didn't really have many games. I mean, we were at Atari 2600, didn't even have NES. Uh, but once I was around 10 or 11... Uh, I got my first Nintendo Entertainment System, and the three most popular games when I first got the system were Super Mario Brothers, uh, Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, and the original Zelda. So there you go. Blazer1974 asks, what do your parties celebrate or are they just for fun? Well, usually they're just for fun, but my next party I'm probably going to have on December 15th and it's going to celebrate my one year anniversary on YouTube. La 101 La La asks, I just went inside a common room of Pot Tropic and saw someone named Mighty Noodle. Do you want to switch names with them or Speedy Catfish okay? Man, I wish I had the choice of getting Mighty Noodle when I got it. I didn't know I could choose that. That's awesome. Cuddly Panda 3000 asks, how many subscribers would it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? Well, when I find out, I'll let you know. Kirby1781 says, think you better answer this question today or I'll kill you. Okay, here it is. Would you rather show your face, sing some random song, or eat a sandwich with apple, chocolate, and raspberry? Don't read this next part till you answer the question. Uh, eat a sandwich with apple, chocolate, and raspberry. Now you have to do what you choose, but I don't have an... Well, I do have an apple and chocolate, but I don't have any raspberries, so sorry, I can't do that for you. Rock and Ronnie Full asks, do you like fresh pasta or hot and spicy noodles? Uh, hot and spicy noodles. Although I really do like a good fresh pasta. The next person asks, did you know what? I've always wanted to go to New York City because it's such a busy place and most of the best restaurants that are there are on a show called Man Vs. Food. Yeah, I have been to a couple of the restaurants on Man Vs. Food. In fact, uh, one of my favorites is Brick Lane Curry House that has the curry that's like the hottest on earth where they make it with a gas mask. <laughs> and trust me, it's really hot. Mega Z West asks, if you had an unlimited $100 bills, would you buy us all CP memberships for life? Of course I would. 3941 Callum asks, what will you do when you find Mickey? I'm not sure what you mean, but did you know that the Disney Imagineers hide Mickeys all over Disney World and you can find the hidden Mickeys? It's really a fun game. Danish Adha asks, can you believe it that you're famous? No, I really can't. And what was your reaction when your YouTube partnership was approved? 
I actually jumped up and down on the sidewalk. I, uh, I got the notice via email to my iPhone and I was ecstatic. It was so cool to, uh, to get the partnership. M. Shem Smith asks, would you rather live in Club Penguin and be the Club Penguin King or live in Pop Tropical World and be the king or live on Noodle Island with all your subs? I would love to live on Noodle Island with all of you guys. X Real Gaming X asks, why did you eat my grandma? Was it because she was eating noodles? No, it was because she was eating my noodles. Chris 880 KDR asks, why did you eat my bald noodle sandwich with extra noodles and supreme baldness? I was saving that. Well, look, when there's something with supreme baldness around, I can't keep my hands off of it. Amy Rules 2000 says, so you think you can get away with it, huh? Don't act innocent. You stole super duper bald, baldy, bald, balm noodles with gummy bear shavings and my especially bald dog frog ice cream unicorn brain pie. What do you have to say for yourself? And no, not sorry for party rocking if you've seen that before. Uh, no excuse. Sorry. I so cavy crazy says, oh my gosh, I'm so furious because you didn't answer any of my questions and no, they weren't inappropriate and they weren't asked. I'm very mad. My question anyway is, would you rather eat noodles for life, be married for life, eat bald noodles for life or eat nothing for life? Well, my wife would kill me if I didn't choose B. <laughs> Victoria Tio says, hey, think, can you answer my question? Who would you say first your noodles or your house and what would you eat for an entire year? Wood or mud, please answer my questions there is one more question guess my age it is under 10 if you guessed eight you're correct um eight got it right m Chem smith says hey think i just got 500 million noodle cups want any ball power sure i could live with you know maybe 100 million to 150 million if you if you could spare some Perry Hunter asks, do you lick Pokemon? And I'm not sure if you were doing that to be funny and say, do you like to lick your Pokemon or do you like Pokemon? And the answer would have to be no for both. I've never licked a Pokemon and I've never played Pokemon, so I can't say whether I like it, but I don't not like it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Milkful says, hey, think, can you say toy train 10 times fast? Toy train, 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 toy train. Okay, I think I got to 10 before I screwed up. You guys can count it. Super X Pokemon X says, hey, thanks for answering my question on the last Ask Think Noodles episode. Can you answer this one? Would you rather eat three noodle ice cream sandwiches or five bowls of Rodman noodles? Well, although I'd get five bowls of noodles, I think a noodle ice cream sandwich would taste better. So I'd go for the three noodle sandwiches. Oliver Cadman says, think, can you answer my questions? Can I be the first question? No, I'm sorry. Can you settle for one of the last ones? Oh God, you are making me mad. You haven't answered my questions for over two months. Answer them now. Cheese or ham? Um, ham and cheese. And have you ever gulped down bald noodles in one go? Of course I have. Who hasn't? Fantabulous49 says, hey, think I wanted to know, please put this in a video. I'm new to YouTube and I'll be cool. How old are you? I'm not going to tell. Do I have glasses? No, I do not wear glasses. I know this isn't a question, but get out of your noodle fabric chair and do 50 noodle jacks. All right, hold on a second. Okay, that's enough. I think I did about eight there. Why'd you steal my cheese puff noodle 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 cheese nachos and anchovies with pizza and wasabi and more cheesy puff noodly thingies? Well, you put wasabi on the noodles. I love wasabi on noodles. Not a question. My favorite word is cheese and cheese puffs. Did you enjoy? Yes. Choose on eating noodles. Yum. Bye. Okay. Chocolate in milk says, can I be first? No. How about second to last? Do you like cheese or cheeses? Yes, I do like cheese and cheeses. And do I hate people who dislike my videos? No, I don't hate them. I mean, I can understand I'm not everyone's cup of tea. And if you watch my video and you didn't like me, it's okay if you dislike the video. I'm okay with it. Although I'd rather you like it. 
Lydia Flower 10 says, Hey, Mr. Think, I am so angry with you. You always put Brandon Cunningham's questions in your videos and you never put mine. Now I might go steal your bald monkey sandwich and stuff it in your ear and then spray it with sour smelling spray and make you cry. Then I might just take all your noodles and run over them with my bike and then went over dog poo. Then I'll shove your noodles in your mouth and laugh at you. My point is put this in your video. I am done now. Maybe. Okay, well, I'm done too. Uh, please take a second to like this video and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys again soon, and thanks for watching.